the Rohingyans who need our help. I want to help them financially, but I want to wait until Ramadan so that my reward will be increased. That is wrong. Someone is dying now and you say die now. I will wait for Ramadan. Is that how you should look at it? Allah will reward you more than the reward that you will achieve in the month of Ramadan because he knows your intention was to wait, but the need is immediate. So give it now. Do we follow? The need is immediate. You do not have to wait for the month of Ramadan to give out your charities. You can give it now. And you can also give in the month of Ramadan. If there is a desperate need, you, you use the need to determine when to give. Not necessarily the space and the time. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guide us all. So if we are people who are very niggardly, very stingy, we don't like to give even one dollar, five dollars when the, when the uh, collection comes around, we don't want to give anything, even one dollar, 50 cents. We don't give. How will we give in the month of Ramadan? Brothers and sisters, when you calculate your zakat, don't be miserly. Don't be a person who says, look, you know what? Uh, it might be 50 or 60 dollars, but let me only use 50 dollars because Allah doesn't need my money. The other 10, I need it more. Astaghfirullah. That's how people think. The young people are very intelligent today. They tell you, does Allah need our money? So the answer is no. So then let me give him less. It's not Allah whom you are giving. It is for the cause of Allah that you are giving. It is for the sake of Allah that you are giving. There are people in greater need than you are. You help them fulfill their need and Allah will help you fulfill yours. When you give a poor person a dollar, you might be helping him build his dunya. But trust me, his dua will help you build your akhirah.